I mean, the, the intimate relationship I've had with all the tribes being invited into their schools and to teach the children. Literally, I don't know how it works, but somehow the Motor City Madman was invited into many Indian tribes to teach their children about the history of the bow hunting lifestyle and the appreciation of God's gifts of food and clothing and shelter and medicine and tools and spirit in the hunting lifestyle. And they've been inviting me for many years, for certainly 40 years, to talk to their children about being clean and sober and that my lifestyle as a, as a white guy, um, though I'm hard to accept that uh, designation, uh, it, it is more in the Indian tradition than many of the Indians themselves. So I've had nothing but not just respect, Lynn, but deep reverence, and it's been reciprocal. I mean, I can just name my friends inviting me to the uh, sweat lodges and to hunt the buffalo with them at the, with the Apaches, the Assiniboine, the Grovan, the Arapaho, the Cheyenne, the Ojibwe, the Blackfoot, the Lakota, the Sioux, the Dakota, the Cherokee, the Nez Perce. I have a spiritual blood brother relationship with these Indians, and then the left literally creates the nastiest, hateful lie they can that I put, put quotes around words attributed to me, Glenn, claiming that I called my red brothers unclean vermin, which I've never said in my life. They created that out of whole cloth. So, um, so then where did they get the vermin thing? Well, because I did an interview, and it was a, a radio show and a TV show and a writer, and of course I'm giving them a, a, a generous identification because I don't think any of them really qualify as anything close to journalists. But then they quoted me in inaccurately because I saw these people, and they are unclean. They're nasty, crazy people. They stink. They smell bad. I had to go through the protesters to get to my concert. And so I called them unclean vermin. I think the term unclean vermin actually describes communist party members bust in to protest my concert okay, to now, just make the concert that much more fun. Now, may I just say, I mean, you can see that calling someone unclean vermin might not be the best choice of words for anyone, especially since... <laughs> You know, we've we've heard other people in other time periods refer to communists as unclean vermin, and it didn't end well. That's my point. I will say what I say. I'm a street fighter. When they attack me with this kind of insanity, I'm going to identify them the way I identify them. <laughs> 